Hey Stampers, welcome to another week of Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey, part of the Stampin' Jill Creative team, and today I'm excited to share with you a technique that makes a really fun card idea. Let me actually show you the card, the full card that we're gonna make today. You can see we're going to do this paper piecing idea here, and I just wanna give you some tips on how to put this together. So, I already have my card base cut, and we're going to just add more strips in here. So I've already done my first three strips and I just kind of eyeballed an area that I wanted my first line to be, okay? And then the next three strips, I've already cut a bunch of strips here and they're just half inch strips and I just trim them as I go. So I'll show you kind of what I do. But I'm going to choose another color that I wanna use, I wanna use this cute stripe one, and I'm just going to line up the edge of it here so that it's in line with these, where these ones stop. So hopefully that makes sense. So I'm just gonna use some adhesive, my stamp and seal, and I'm just going to eyeball kind of the same distance between and just line that up so it's a straight line, okay? And then I turn it over and I trim from the back, okay? And then I choose another piece. Try and decide what one I want. Do that one. And I just line it up right next to that. And I'm just gonna continue to build that scrap card all the way. So, trim like that. And then we'll do, hmm, I have to decide what I want. Maybe I'll do some of this adhesive, put it on, and then trim from the back. Now you could wait to trim until it's all on, but I like to keep it nice and clean and straight. So I trim as I'm going. So I have three more um, strips there that are all lined up. Well, here I'm going to switch the direction of the card again, or of the strips again, and I'm going to do them this way. So they're kind of, I don't know, what, what's the right word? Skitty wampus on the page. So they're not all going the same direction. Okay, put some adhesive on, line that up just like before, and then trim. And then again, and trim. And then one more, because we have to finish our three there. Let's do this one, just like that. Oop. When it's kind of a teeny tiny spot there, it gets a little trickier to hold it on while you trim, but we'll get it just like that, okay? And then we'll come down here next. So then I'm going to choose this one for down here. This paper is so cute. This is the Hey Sports Fan Designer Series paper that is available right now in the mini catalog. And it is so fun, perfect for making masculine card ideas. But this idea is awesome because if you just have a bunch of paper scraps, really it doesn't matter even where they come from, they will go together and make such cute cards. I love doing this with different scraps I have just to kind of use up all those little pieces. And if you are wondering about all the measurements on this card, like I said, these are all half inch strips, but if you need to know any other measurements, we also have a blog post that you can go and visit our, our website at stampinjill.com. Okay, and then we're just gonna keep building. So I really like these pieces that have lots of color in them, that kind of gives a lot of interest down there, like that. Trim, and we're getting close here. 
Okay, so this one has, it doesn't have um, the two edges on both sides, so I'm just going to make that a straight edge. When it's such a small piece, it kind of makes it easier to do that. I don't know if these are golf balls or baseballs, but they're cute, whatever they are. Okay. Get some more red stripes in there. Oh, I love it. These are perfect for the sports fan in your life. Almost there. Oh, just trim that teeny tiny piece off. Okay, so just like that, you have a really fun, cool background. And let me bring in the finished card. So you can see I really made the rest of the card very simple. Um, I just added a little saying and put some um, ribbon in there. The interest of the card is that paper PC background and it just does so much for that card. So let me show you a few other ideas I came up with using this technique. So we had a male one. Now here's a feminine one. Happy mom day. So cute. And then this is just a little different of an idea. The same, the same thought, but instead of doing them sideways, I just did them all horizontal. And I love you. Super cute. So easy. It is a little time consuming, but it makes a really fun finished product. So I hope you take some scraps from your house and because I know you all have them. Take them and piece them together and make some really fun backgrounds for your cards. And if you have any questions about the products, there will be links in the comments below. And if you have any questions, make sure to go visit our blog post at stampinjail.com. Thanks so much, and we'll see you next week for another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.